Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. It's me department here playing the alt account in this video series where I am playing a fresh character. Not the current one climbing the ladders that's well polished but this guy. He is a default giant. He has no game passes. And only two pets. So... We don't even have a million gold pets, so that's what today's video is here for. As you see, I do finally have a million gold, and it took quite a long time. Borak has died many times for this gold. Many, many times. And actually, so have some players in the arena, actually. Um, because those are the best ways to get gold right now. Besides running around, picking up the orbs, but my multiplier is so low. That that gold doesn't really give an extreme amount in my wallet. So the most efficient way is to come slay Borak as often as he's up and get those arenas going because the multipliers at least give you a few hundred gold each time. Borak is probably a little better uh, because he gives you loot and that sells as well. So on average, I'm getting about five, seven hundred every time Borak's up. If I do the arena, it's a couple hundred. Uh, with the arena, you can finish some quests at the same time. Um, so you can do the quests and your downtime. All that stuff, it adds up. It takes a lot of time. But until you start getting gold multipliers, it is going to take a long time. So I'm only at five rebirths. Um, a few more since the last video. And I made it a goal to not spend any gold. <laughs> Besides getting the two weapons and the skin, the legendary. Because that is kind of a critical part taking my own tips from the very first video um, because they'll scale with you they scale I did enchant them to level 10 which is really nothing but I thought you know slap a little bit of additional enchantment on them as you can see Onox champions 18 and I just got this venom uh, not too long ago what is it eight levels ago this dropped off Borak he drops legendaries if only I got this sooner um, so I decided not to equip it because it's not as strong as these enchanted ones, and I knew I was going to probably rebirth relatively soon. Um, so I'm going to save that money. I'm going to sell it before I rebirth and use one of the pro tips from the first video and stock up on 28 of these lobby pets. Why 28? Because I have 28 free slots. So if I fill up 28 more pets, I rebirth, I'll be able to sell each one for 1,000 gold and get 28,000 gold instantly upon rebirth which is a quarter of the way there towards my first legendary chest so that any bit helps any bit helps indeed so that's the plan to have at least a hundred and forty thousand gold before i do rebirth because uh, that's what 28 times five is 140 so 140 thousand gold is what i'll need but today's video we're finally here we're going to buy the very first million gold pet on this noob account Will I get the elusive Mantu 0.1%? Will I get Venom? Bastet. Trimid? Ghoul? Frost? Who knows? We will see when we give that a click. Hopefully it's a good one, but you know what? At this point, it doesn't even really matter because any gold multiplier is better than no gold multiplier. Especially when you put the rebirth points in to make it rain and keep on doing it. You'll get more and more gold and start. that's really how you start started the steam engine in the giant simulator game. It's all about the gold and how you maximize and work towards the gold. So let's go ahead and get to the point of this video. Thank you all for sticking around listening to me. Let's go ahead and give it a click. What do you think it's going to be? You think I'll get the Montu on my very first? You think it'd be Venom? I hope it's Venom. Venom's awesome. Venom was the first one I got on Meat Department. And let me tell you, Venom is pretty awesome looking. Let's give it a click. Oh, it's Frost, of course. It's Frost. Frost. You would. It's okay, though. It is still a gold multiplier. Let's go ahead and slap on Frost. Who do we want to take off? Anubis going bye bye. Okay, unequip. 
and equip. So we lose a little bit of XP and speed boost, but that's going to quickly go up since he starts out at a base 375. And of course, the gold multiplier is now kicking. So what are we getting? 17 a tick, okay. I think it was, what, 11 or 12 a tick just before I put that on. So already got 60% more gold. Getting 60% more gold, and now he leveled up to level 1. So there we go. About 75% more gold already than what I was getting per tick. Uh, so that's pretty significant. And this is just going to skyrocket in levels pretty quick. You know, up to a reasonable amount. Obviously, I only have five rebirths, so there's going to be a point where it starts to slow down again probably in a couple levels. But we'll go ahead and uh, watch Frost level up here until that bar starts slowing down. There we go, level two. All right. 20, wow. We almost doubled the gold tick just by getting one pet. And that's it. The second goal, or the second thing I'm going to do on this new character is probably get up to 140,000 gold. Or I guess I need 135,000 now. Fill out my pet slots. And then I'll go ahead and give it the old rebirth so I could put some points into the talent tree. Should be able to do this a couple rounds. Uh, add my percentages up a little bit more. And then we'll really start to to level a little bit more faster um, after that I'm probably gonna push it out again it'll be a little faster this time to the other to another million gold and get a second gold pet um, definitely and then maybe we'll try to spam rebirthing at reasonable levels so we could build that talent tree up so it gets a little bit stronger then you know there's gonna be certain limitations due to being a default giant and not having any game passes which really boosts things up uh, but we'll see what WoW goes. Frosty is level 3. Give me, oh, 0.85 extra now. Nice. So what do we got? We're ending with 21 to tick. Beautiful. Let's see, is Borak up? 10 seconds. We'll, we'll finish the video with the Borak kill, see what he gives with this multiplier. And that'll be it. Let's see. We'll help everyone out. Oh, we got a guy in here. 18 rebirth, so he'll do some good hits. There we go. Let's get Borak down here. Let's see what our boy drops today. Warbringer, nice. Oh, I missed what it gave me. I'll have to go back in the video and check it out. Um, but yeah, not bad. So that was it. Did you think I was going to get Frost? Or did you think I was going to get Matu? What do you think? Write it in the comments below. Which one did you think I was going to get? Was I going to get the lowest tier or the highest tier or somewhere in between? Honestly, I was hoping for Venom. Uh, he's pretty awesome looking too. He looks really cool. Uh, he's got really good multiplayer on him. But hey, maybe when I get that next million, we'll see what it is. But until that time comes, I'll keep grinding away on this account. We'll just keep swinging, having fun, helping everyone out, having a good old time. Again, I appreciate everything. If you enjoy the videos, the content, have anything you'd like to see, feel free to leave it in the comments below. But all of your support has been tremendous, and I do appreciate it. So if you do enjoy the video, enjoy the content, hit like, subscribe for updates, and until next time, keep swinging. Bye-bye.